Okay, this is part three. I'm hoping I don't have to record that last video because it's over 15 minutes, but let's see. You know what? I'm not even going to go through the rest of these colors, but these are like all the other patina ones I got. I think there might be, yeah, a lot of them look like the RVT. So those are fun. I never tried those before. And then I got another Distress Stain in pink, pi sorry, picked raspberry. That was that. That was that. Okay, next are ink pads. That was my main goal was ink pads, not distress ink ink pads. So these are the ones I was looking at. They are the Adirondack Brights Pig Pigment Ink Pad. I got Sunset Orange. Uh this is embossed tinted. Lettuce. Okay, Jenny Bolin, Lemon Drop, Weathered Vine, I'm saving the Distressed Ink for story, Archival Teal, Denim, Stone washed. Antiquities Rose Quartz worth a shot. Archival in pale pale. Cranberry. Clover. Dale Boat Blue, I like that color. Lavender sat, uh, Satchet by Jenny Bolin. I have people asking, Jenny Bolin is discontinued. Sunshine Yellow. Eggplant. Mushroom. Bottle. Red pepper, and these are like six dollars a piece. Seed packet, I don't know if I said that one. Terracotta, espresso, wild plum. Peach Bellini, orange, and these people will probably be jealous about. This is in that box of mixed stuff. I will never buy these in the store because they're too expensive, but it's the Tim Holtz Ranger Distress Collection cardstock. This is um, the four and a half by five and a half. No. Four and a quarter by five and a half. So I got. Is it a different one? Yeah, there is. I got the Distress Collection and I got one Craft Core. And then I got a Craft Core Nostalgic Collection six by six bed. I was so happy to get those. That's big. Um, okay, I'm going to do this distress story real fast. Okay, so I was at the right place at the wrong time. Fast story. And the guy put the rack of distress inks in me, and I think they were all the seasonal releases. And I, I got one of each, and I was so happy, and I put them in my bucket, and I showed my friends, and they loved them, and I gave them all away, and I only kept two for myself. I was upset, so I was like, I picked the two I wanted. I was like, you know what, give me Squeeze Lemonade, and I want Ripe Persism. Okay, well, I was wondering, I was like, looking at the back, and I'm like, oh, maybe that's why it was there, because one labeled, one's not. Oh, not for individual sale, so this must have been for a reason. And then all of a sudden, I'm like, why is this one so... 
it's empty. So I was a good friend. I gave all the just all the nice new seasonal distress inks away to my friends, and I got one, just one, one. That's it. But whatever. I'm a good friend. So I don't care. But I have the package to laugh about and take a photo and put it in Project Life. Give me one second. Let me get my other bag now. I'm going to be making another video of non-rangers and cool stuff. Okay, so just to laugh, there was a, we got there, this lady is selling stuff out of the trunk of her car. So, I don't need lace, but it was a bundle of five strands, and this is like ruffled. Five strands for, it's five strands per bundle, is two bundles for a dollar. So I got, I think I got, I don't know, I got like five dollars worth, I think. I gave her five dollars, I don't even know if I got five dollars worth. But it was just so cold, and I didn't want to stand there anymore. Um, okay. Oh, I got a brown sugar Jenny Bowen one. I got another seed packet, which is for Secret Santa. I keep saying Secret Santa, and they're gonna find out who. They're gonna find out. Who. The fuck? Oh, something leaked. I don't want to know what. Whatever. I got big and juicy. Oh, I don't know what it is. Big and juicy soothing sunset. That alone's like ten bucks. I got one brayer. One. I don't. I wanted. I'm not even going to talk about it because some of these people are nasty. And karma comes back. I don't think it's my body. I think it's the embossing pad. Yep, it is. I got a big embossy clear. They had a ton of these, but I only got one because I have one and I barely use it. And it's like too juicy, I think. I don't know. But I got that nice blue archival ink. I love Ocago ink, so those I was in. Oh, good, I got a se uh, sepia, and I got the reinker for that one. And I got maroon, and I got the reinker for that. Yes. Score. Nobody thought to buy the reinkers. This is more stuff from Maxim Holt's box that I was so excited about. I got a, a pocket comb. I guess it goes with these no little niblet nibs things that they have. And then I got a craft holder, whatever. Then I got two Ink Essential bone folders. I got a pack of craft nibs. There we go. I got a pack of mini misters. They had a whole, they had a bucket, but the woman took the whole, the the whole bag filled. So I was like, whatever. I got a water brush. This is a detailer tip. I got another bone folder. Another bone folder. Then I got it's this type of bone folder. I got three of those. And I got a half inch black tip water brush. There we go. I think looks so fat on this video. I got a pack of the Ranger Stamp Cleaner. I don't know. I forgot to ask anybody who got that last year if it was any good. I got Magenta Archival Link. I got um, Craft Core. The, is this 2x12? I got some of the metallic. Um, I don't know what this is. Okay, then I got more, um, I got more tabs. These are craft tabs, size 10. I got three packs of those. Uh, these are the giant tabs, size 
12. I got three packs of those. The these are the normal Tim Holtz ones. Five, eight. I got two packs of those. Those women were pissed, but I don't care because they were pushing me out of the way the entire day. They had some of the clothing helmet stamps. I was able to get this one. Ah, uh, what? Whatever it is, it's all over the bed. I have to do that in, that in boss. I got these clear ones because I know it leaked on me last time. I got, oh, five, five, ten black um, tips. Five, five manila tips. Five, eight craft tips. That's super sad. I got another one of these, uh, craft core doohickeys. That's not even scrap related. I got another melt art in these colors. I got some more mini misters. I got these stamps. I got these. I got these. Okay, this this was weird. This came in a box. They said there was some one of the people was found this in a random box, but there's more of them, and I didn't know that. I gave the box to Bernetta to alter that they came in, but they are um calligraphy ink. I'm like, you know what? They come in these boxes. They're, so, they're all fancy schmancy. They're made. Fireball? I don't know. But I got black. I got pinkly. Smoky. Blue Bahama. Skies of blue. And always greener. That alone is probably a pound, but I got six of them. Another water brush, another paper creaser. I got some of these collage glue sticks. Even though I have, I I bought them all on clearance at Michaels, and I haven't used any of those. But you know what? It's a glue stick. So I got, I got three individuals. Okay, I got um, a distress marker and milled lavender. They had, I think that was like somebody's leftover. Those are extras. <coughs> got the perfect um, medium in black. And I got the reinker. I should have got more in the reinker because the pad is oh, good for like ever. I had two more of these, but of course I was, I'm a nice friend and gave them away. These are the Tim Holt ink palettes. I already have a couple. So, whatever. Um three pack of alcohol inks like espresso and I can't really see the other two colors. A uh, perfect medium brush pen. Craft tags size 8 in black. I'm sorry. Tags craft black size 8. Denim and Boston powder. Manila tags in size 5. And more of these like squishy thingies. Um, so okay, actually I think that is everything. I think that is. So thanks everybody for watching my video. I'm coming back with one more. Um it was it's of a whole related stuff. We went to Hobby Lobby and just another other than I believe. Yep. So thanks for watching everybody and have a great night.